I'm here in front of the Ocean Riviera Paradise Resort here just outside of Playa de la Carma, Mexico. The goal of this video is just to take you guys on a tour of the resort and show you what this place has to offer. They've got a beautiful massive lobby here, the huge bar. Uh, over there is where they try to sell you excursions and right here is the piano bar. And once you will leave this place, it's really amazing. This place is like a village of just free stuff to do. This is a big live theater with uh, shows every night. Last night we watched The Lion King and it was amazing. The night before that was the Mexican night, we didn't watch that. And the night before that was the pop, the pop show. And that was really good as well. And here's the bowling alley. It's 10 pin, lots of fun. Here's our first of many restaurants. Route 66 it's called. It's an American based restaurant. We went there once to get appetizers and it was amazing. I highly rec recommend the pulled pork sandwiches. This is the Japanese restaurant. Very good food there. It's the only one that you need reservations for here on this resort. Uh, it's where they like cook in front of you and do a cool show. We got the Italian. We got tennis courts, basketball courts, a full-size gym that's open 24 hours. It's right in there. It's all glass windows. It's really nice. I'm not going to show you inside though because who wants to be filmed while they're working out? Oh yeah, and there's also a batting cage. I haven't tried it, but that if that's your thing, that's cool. If you're a fan of Starbucks and fancy coffee, they got the place for you. It's called Mike's. It's got all your fancy French presses and desserts and everything you could possibly want. Then of course they got your uh, ice cream shop, your fine dining romantic restaurant, casino, then all those other random stores that you can go and uh, waste your money on. And that's all within the first hundred meters. Right here we have the main buffet. Waffles, to pancakes, to donuts, to crepes, to sausage, omelets, anything you can imagine at a buffet. Lunch has got steak, roast beef, uh, tacos, more crepes, just, just anything you can imagine. And it's all really good. They have a teen club and a mini club. Here we got the steakhouse that we're gonna try tonight and the Mexican restaurant right beside it. Mexican restaurant also serves as a secondary breakfast buffet. This is a huge resort and they've got all kinds of pools. Kids pool, adults only pool. This is the privilege pool, but anybody can use it. Almost every hotel butt building thing has one of these uh, pools you can walk off your balcony into. And this is the fun activity pool. Looks like they're playing some water polo right now. We do aquafit every day here at noon. And this is the beautiful beach pool. Looks like they're doing a beach barbecue today. That's exciting. And this is the beach. It's been quite windy this week. So all the water sports have been canceled, but there's usually kayaking and water paddling. Water paddling? This is a big snack bar on the beach. It's got homemade pizza that's really good, and it's got some other meat, hamburgers, um, some good options. They're all really good. Uh, just a smaller selection than the other buffets. This cute little shack here makes uh, real fruit smoothies. They actually use real fruit. I haven't seen that at a resort before. All the other bars just mix the uh, mix like grenadine and the fake sugary stuff, which is still good. This video has been a bit jumpy, so it might be a bit confusing uh, how it's all laid out. But basically, I started here, and it's just one big pathway all the way down to the beach. And the pools and hotel rooms are all just scattered about this one single path. 
Luckily for those of you who don't like to walk on their, your holidays, there is a tram here that takes you from one side of the walk to the other and you can get on and off wherever you want. Every single pool here has a swim out bar and then there's just lots of bars around you can walk up to. There's no shortage of that. They've got this sea note that usually has cool animals. Hmm. See the iguana right there? Shuffleboard, this hacky sack game. Got it. Ping pong. And now for a tour of the room. So we are in the privileged building. We didn't book privilege, but they just put us in here because all the other ones were full. Uh, it's a bit messy, but uh, take it for what it is. So here it is, you turn left and you've got a jacuzzi, shower, toilet, double sink. We've got two double beds, would they be? TV, pull-out couch, and a patio. Our patio overlooks another resort beside us, and we have a jacuzzi, which would be great if it was like cold and snowing outside. So yeah, I think that concludes the tour of this resort. Really enjoyed myself here, impressed with the food. If you have any questions about this resort, or for me in general, just leave them down in the comments. I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. All right guys, have a good one.